hello guys welcome once again in this video i will show you how to use multiple document interface or mdi with your windows form c sharp application so mdi you can use it for hosting multiple form inside a parent form so for this i will create a new project and this will be my windows form application and i will name it as mdi one for example and create a new project it will open a form one and this form for example we want to make this form as MDI parent so just select this form go to the properties and there is one property called is MDI container false just make it true and when you make this is a MDI container true and go to this form 1 you will be able to see that it has converted to MDI container so for demonstration I will create two more forms form 2 and form 3 so this will be my windows form form 2 I will keep my form 2 name as default and I will create one more form add new and form 3 so I have created two more form first form is my MDI container and second and third form I will show inside my MDI container form which is form 1 for the demonstration I will take menu strip and I will name this menu strip as new and I will open form 2 form 2 and form 3 inside this form 1 and I will show you two ways of opening first is with only one instance of this form and second opening multiple instance of the form so first double click this form 2 and we will go to the code above this method just declare form 2 f2 variable and inside this uh, form to tool strip menu item click event write if bracket and bracket close first f2 is equal to null then we will open new instance so f2 is equal to new form 2 bracket and bracket closed and we need to declare with what is the parent of this of form 2 so write f2 dot mdi parent is equal to this so this tells this form 2 that form 1 is the parent of this and then we will just show this form or else if the form is already opened we can say that just activate the form so form 2 dot activate bracket and bracket close and you can also provide the form closing event or form closing condition so just go after this MDI parent is equal to this just write f2 dot form closed just write plus and is equal to and either ju just click this new form closed event handler or just press tab button two times one and two it will create uh, this f2 form close event automatically S and in here there will be a code inside throw new not implemented exception so just comment it and just write f2 is equal to null so when you close your form it will set this f2 variable as null so this will open only one instance of your form 2 let's make the code for form 3 opening and for form 3 we will open multiple instances of this form 
so I will double click this form and I will write form 3 f3 is equal to new form and I will declare the form 3 MDI parent is equal to this and I will just show this form so f3 dot show so this code will open multiple instances of form 3 and the code for f2 will open only one instance of form 2 so let's try and run the program I have this form 1 and I have this 2 menu item button when I click this F2 it will open F2 form 1 so and I can open F3 form multiple times but if I want to open this F2 form once again this will only activate this form 2 it will not open the new instance of form 2 okay so it just opens the form 2 only once so in this way you can use MDI for uh, containing multiple forms inside your main MDI form. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment and subscribe and bye for now.